Welcome to the Bodymetrics Performance Monitor. Here are the features of your performance monitor. On the front, the touch screen, the infrared temperature sensor, the internal SPO2 sensor, the home power on and off button, the multifunctional connector USB, and the ECG right electrode. On the back, the ECG back electrode, the speaker, the ECG left electrode, and the neck strap hole. The Bodymetrics app is also available for immediate download. Before setting up your performance monitor, please download the latest Bodymetrics mobile app from the Apple iTunes or Google Play stores, and it's free. Here are some warning reminders. This product is not suitable for people wearing a pacemaker or any other internal medical device. This product is not a medical device and should not be used to diagnose or treat any medical condition. Do not use this device in direct sunlight or in very bright fluorescent lighted areas. No or inaccurate results may occur. Do not drop your device or submerge it in water. It is not waterproof. General navigation. Your device has two main menu screens. Use the arrows on the right or left of the screen to move between the menu screens. You can always return to the date and time screen by tapping the home button. Settings. Tap the home button. Navigate to the second screen by tapping the right arrow. Tap the settings icon on the second menu screen of your device. Tap the language tab to choose what language you want to use, English or Spanish only. Tap the date and time tab to enter the date and time of the day. Tap the arrow at the bottom of the screen to complete your entry and return to the settings menu. Tap user management and then select the plus sign to create your user profile. Enter the information requested. The ID number is a unique combination of letters and numbers to identify you. Tap the X box to save. Tap the voice guide option to turn on or off the voice prompts. Tap the volume chart one to three times to raise or lower the volume of the voice guide. How to hold your device so you can take all your vitals. Left palm on the ECG left electrode, right index finger into the SPO2 sensor, right thumb on the ECG right electrode, and right middle finger on the ECG back electrode. Looking at the front of the device, on the bottom right there is a round silver sensor. Please place your right hand thumb on this sensor and your third finger on the rectangular silver sensor on the back. On the left side of the device is a long silver sensor. When taking your heart activity body check or relax me test, place your open left palm against this silver sensor. On the upper right hand side of the device is a small trap door. While holding the device with your thumb and third finger as above, slide your index finger, the finger next to your thumb, under the door. How to measure your heart activity or heart rate. Before beginning, sit down, relax, and hold the device as shown and rest your elbows or forearms on a table. Stay relaxed during the measurement as exerting too much pressure or actively moving may affect conductivity. Dry skin or thick calluses may also affect conductivity, so moisten your fingers and or your palms to improve conductivity when necessary. Press the heart activity icon, then tap your name. Make sure you're touching three silver sensors outlined above and the device shows your heart activity wave. Pulse oximeter. How to measure your blood oxygenation or SpO2. Before beginning, please sit down and relax. Staying relaxed and not actively moving during your measurement will improve performance. Tap the pulse oximeter icon on your device screen. Gently insert your right index finger under the plastic flap on the upper right hand side of your device. 
Do not press down too hard on sensor as it may impact your normal blood flow and cause less accurate readings. The reading will begin once your finger is in place and you will see a red glowing light. Calibrating your systolic blood pressure or SBP. Your systolic blood pressure number is the top number and diastolic is the bottom number. Please take your blood pressure using an armband or cup-based blood pressure monitor, not included, while seated and relaxed. Please write this number down and proceed to the SBP calibration. Please calibrate your systolic blood pressure once every 90 days. Calibration and Body Check Systolic Blood Pressure How to calibrate your SBP on your device Tap the Home button Tap the right arrow to move to the second menu screen Tap Settings Tap the arrow at the bottom right of your screen Tap SBP Calibration Tap your name Tap Done to proceed a number pad will appear. Please enter your systolic blood pressure you wrote down and press OK. Now touch all four sensors on your device. The device will begin calibrating your blood pressure by itself if you are holding it properly. When complete, your performance monitor will display calibration successful. Should the SBP calibration fail, please turn off your device by holding down the Home button for three seconds. Turn your device back on by holding the Home button for one to two seconds and repeat the steps above. If you are unable to calibrate your device, please visit our support page at www.bodymetrics.com and enter Calibrate in the search box. Body Check – How to Measure All Your Vital Signs Tap the Body Check icon, then tap your name. Before beginning, please sit down and relax and rest your arms on a table. Staying relaxed and not actively moving during your measurement will improve performance. Dry skin or thick calluses may also affect conductivity. The reading will begin when your hands are in place and the waveforms show on your screen. Temperature, Relax Me, and Pedometer. Temperature. Tap the temperature icon on your device screen. Tap the username or add a new one. Tap the body icon on your device screen. Put the temperature sensor on your temple as shown. Tap and release the home button, then scan toward the forehead. The measurement is finished when you hear a loud beep. Relax Me Tap the Relax Me icon on your device screen. You will be inhaling and exhaling during the process. Tap Username or add a new one. Before beginning, sit down, relax, hold the device gently as shown, and rest your arms on a table. Stay relaxed during the measurement as exerting too much pressure or actively moving may affect conductivity. Follow the breathing pattern as shown above, inhaling as the indicator moves upward and exhaling as it moves downward. Tap the home button to stop the measurement at any time. You will receive your relaxation index upon stopping the measurement. The higher the score, the more relaxed you are. Pedometer. Tap the pedometer icon on your device screen. Tap username or add a new one. Tap the flag icon to set a goal distance for your steps and fat burn. Tap the home button to stop and calculate. Reports, reminders, and Bluetooth. Reports. Tap the reports icon on your device screen. Tap username or add a new one. Tap the individual report icon that you want to review. Select the user you want to track and the dated report. 
Follow the on-screen instructions. Reminders. Tap the Reminders icon on your device screen. Tap Username or add a new one under Settings for New Users. Tap the plus sign, then enter a task or event. Select the day and the month of the year. Bluetooth. First, communicate between your device and a smartphone. You will need to open your Bodymetrics mobile app. Tap the Bluetooth icon on your device screen. On your mobile app, select Search for Device. Select your device serial number from the list to connect. If there is a new version of the device firmware, your mobile app will ask you if you want to update. Select Yes.